Well, I, you know, being from New England again, I, you know, having two days off there, I was okay because that's the most dangerous part of it. I wasn't excited about closing school Thursday and Friday, but then again, we conferred with National Weather Service forecasts, and when they said the temperatures were going to plummet, you know, maybe as low as uh, tonight, 15 to 20 below zero, we can't risk having students, uh, you know, driving in and our faculty and staff moving around campus in those kind of conditions. So actually, it was a good decision. And you can see just while the facilities folks have done a good job on the snow, there's quite a bit of ice around too. It's going to take several days of warm weather to get this stuff out of here. I think our facility staff is fantastic. They were out here right from the get-go, starting on uh, Sunday, trying to get ready for Monday. And of course, this, you know, the snow just came on so hard on Monday. It was just impossible to open the campus. Have you ever seen a snow like this on campus? Uh, yeah, uh, but it was a long time ago. It was back uh, probably in the 80s, uh, early 90s, uh, back when I was in school myself. It's been a while. You know, we got a lot of snow uh, quick, and and it, it was all the timing. And, and what I mean by that is a lot of snow came in right around the, you know, 3 o'clock, 4 o'clock in the morning time frame. Uh, and some of it lasted up until, especially yesterday, up until mid-morning and uh, you know it, we don't have a four hour delay uh, I don't even know if, if that would have been appropriate uh, even yesterday um, when you consider the commuters that we have uh, and staff faculty uh, there's a lot of people coming in you know that time of morning so a lot of side roads are still treacherous uh, slick uh, ice on them and of course today and and tomorrow you know, we're looking at sub-zero uh, temperatures. You know, I love to be with the students, and you know, I was over here every day this week, uh, you know, taking videos and pictures and you know, teasing the kids and so forth. Kids are kids, right? They're having a ball, and uh, they're glad to have some time off, but it's, it's time to quit having fun. Let's go back to class. Our goal, of course, is to be open on Monday, but we'll just have to monitor the weather very carefully, and um, I'm hopeful that we'll be able to open, but we won't know until we see what actually happens.